Hey ho, one and all, big lorry, Thursday evening in another wonderful, wonderful sunny blue sky day here in the east of Scotland. Aye, it's a great place to live. This is my classic Whitman album from a Mercury Dimes. And a wee while back, Silver Wolverine got in touch with me and he said he would send me a few of the ones I'm missing for my collection for the full set. I think I'm nine or ten short or something like that. And that includes, of course, the <laughs> 16D. But um, it came today, so it was wonderful going to pick it up at the post office. Um, I'd been kind of tracking it and uh, it said uh, on the tracking today, it was in my PO box at the post office. Which is interesting, seeing as I don't have one. But uh, it was there waiting for me. So he sent us a little note and it says, Big Laurie, this package uh, is uh, way overdue. Uh, months in the making, lol. Hope you enjoy these coins and helps with your set. I'm sure they will. Wonderful stuff. I would have sent it sooner, but it took me <laughs> a couple of months to write the note. <laughs> Laugh out loud. And that's from Silver Wolverine. So let's have a look and see what we have. Nice little envelope. The package that it came in was uh, it had stickers and import stickers and all sorts of stuff over it. So uh, it was just uh, a mess. So I'm not going to um, dwell on that. So um, I actually sent him a note saying which ones uh, if he had I'd be interested in. So all of these are nice and new to the set. 1919D in wonderful condition. A 24D perfect day. Eh? 1926D, these all fill in gaps. Perfect. And a 1926 San Francisco. So, all I can see is I'm going to pop them in the album. You'll forgive me for um, taking them out of the flips, but I'll do my damnedest not to rip my fingers to bits with the staples, and uh, we will pop them in the album. And uh, I will, of course, when I come back when they're in the album, and you can have a look at them. Thank you uh, very much. But just to put it on record, uh, Silver Wolverine, extremely kind of you. Uh, it didn't matter how long it took. You were kind enough to offer to send these to me, uh, so uh, they're a wonderful gift. And uh, you've no idea, well, you do know how much I love US Constitutional, but the fact that this will tick off four more uh, and uh, getting towards my, my goal of hitting the set uh, is uh, of huge value and uh, huge pleasure to me. So thanks again, my friend. Uh, and uh, everybody else, give us a couple of minutes and, uh, well, a couple of seconds for you, I guess. And, uh, and the battery light is flashing on my camera, so who knows how long it's going to actually take but we'll have another look at them in the album. Thanks just now. Okay guys, we're back. Or he is. Yeah, he is. I'm doing my reading. Callum's doing some reading. Because my mom told me to. Well, it's kind of homework. Got the book so, from school to do reading. It's a BFG, but Callum... I've got to read from 89... Page 89 to... To, 106, to the end of 106. Hmm. So the start of 107. But you find that a bit dull because you read this book at home last year, didn't you? Back end of last year. Yeah, and also I've seen the movie like five Well, times, yeah, you've so seen the movie, but that's not the point, is it? Uh, however, here we are, stretching it out to 30 seconds already. So, got these. Thanks again, Silver Wolverine. Here we go. 1919D in its place. 1924D. There we and go. Way, guys, if you hear me sniff, if you hear something sniffling, it's just me. If I hear but something <laughs> sniffling in the background, it's you. It's me because my nose is quite... Runny. Yeah. Is it a cold, or is it getting over last week's cold, or is it hay fever, or is it just sniffly? Cold, I think. I think it's just the remnants of your cold, eh? And so now we can move over the page. 
I don't know why I'm having so much because <laughs> I bust one yep yeah. and then up to the top here 1926D and the 1926S right beside it so there they are there and I will try not to sniffle it's alright you don't have to worry about not sniffling being sniffly so that's it so thanks again Wolverine um, an immense step forward so we'll only get two of those and a couple of these to find uh, and obviously the elusive 2016 or 1916 even D but let's not worry about such things we've got those ones we've got that one and that one and they're just about in focus so thank you very much for your kindness um, if there's ever anything we can do for you you know only to say the word uh, and maybe we'll have to have a little think put our heads together Callum and see what we can do to send something special over to the the I world. Do you? Do I need to tell you? No, we'll I keep it. No, it's fine because we probably won't send it anyway. What? Chocolate. Chocolate, right. <laughs> yeah, okay, we will send some chocolate at the very <laughs> least. <laughs> we'll, try, we'll try and bring, we'll, try, we'll order a fridge, we'll bring that and we'll put the chocolate in it for you. <laughs> we'll order a, a, a fridge, they call them ice boxes in the States I think. Yeah, but we, and we'll, we'll post that and it might have a bar of chocolate in it for you. But in the meantime... And also, you've got an extra fridge just in case. Just uh, Yeah, indeed, that would be a or spare just fridge. another freezer. Cool. Good stuff. So thank you very much again for that. Thank you, everybody else, for watching. It's the end of a video, so what do we say, please? Like, subscribe, comment. Good. Bad. Or indifferent. And until the next time, Have goodbye. A Goodbye everybody and uh, thanks for watching but more especially thanks you thank you very much Wolverine for these uh, wonderful little coins you know how much they mean to me and one of these days they might even mean the same to him hey Mark Dimes <laughs> no he shakes his head right take care everybody and we'll see you in the next one